Hey team. <laughs> Welcome back guys. I'm gonna be honest, still upset about this Barbie mermaid thing. I, I, you know, it's always sad when the things you loved as a child are looked at in the light of day. No, 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 Gina, this has nothing to do with nostalgic purposes. This has nothing to do with me. Actually, I, I'm fighting for a cause. Barbie makes dreams come true. And this mother, I, I understand maybe, maybe her child, um, doesn't dream big enough, but, um, She's you know, she's ruining it for um the dreamers. Maybe out there. being a mermaid just wasn't enough. And what's enough, Gina? Is, what's it, enough? is anything enough at that point? Uh, what's enough? Um, good health care. <laughs> so is that enough? Badly on this level. <laughs> this was the level that made me quit last time. I know. Right? I just <laughs> want to see. I'm reminding <laughs> myself of why. Just want to make sure, like, uh, <laughs> we know what happened. Um. Oh, hey. We, we're having a really good record today of, like, sticking with games. <laughs> like, what do you mean? Well, we also bailed on Lost Kingdom. Oh, we good. did. Oh, if you want to see something sad, check out our Lost Kingdom's playthrough, which we beat the final boss of. Yeah, no, we... we it, look, oh, we played it from the beginning of the game to the defeat of the final boss, and I am satisfied. That's a lie. I am... I am. I wasn't playing that game. I'm, no, you I didn't. I actually <laughs> never looked up at the screen. No, you didn't. <laughs> Actively didn't look up. I, I'm working on this Sans thing. Oh, spoiler alert. Uh, <laughs> Every time. <laughs> I'm practicing. I'm doing really well. I think it would be really funny if, like, years later, we're still, like, so, uh... Someone's <laughs> working on the Sans the sa fight. <laughs> look, at, look at me dancing like a ballerina. <laughs> and Tails is just, like, wasn't enough for Chaos. Also, I pointed out last time, but he like yawns or picks his nose. I can't tell what he's doing. I think he's yawning, but like, why is Tails yawning? I don't know. Tails, your life is so interesting. <laughs> I understand you're just like hanging also, look out. Also, your in best friend right now. Your best friend has, <laughs> has been some doing... birds, and I'm a ballerina now. I think we have all the birds we need. By the by, boing, you boing, can boing. you can progress. Wait, boing, boing, boing. Oh God, look Good at how fast job. I go. Well done. Now you have to go through the. Yeah. No. Okay. No, other way. I wanted those two rings. Tails needs some rings. Nice. That was great. Okay. Um, <laughs> cool. Um, Remember, you're now ringless, so if you get hit by that thing. Interesting theory. <laughs> yes? Is this your joke now? Your interesting theory? <laughs> um, so, <laughs> do, you, do you... Do you... Do you still have the um, Sonic stuff up on your phone? Uh, yeah. I want to see if I can remember what we learned when you and I first went through this. Oh, list. that would actually would be interesting. Yeah. Okay. And um, and see if I I can go farther. Okay. We're putting my Sonic knowledge to the test. The answer I lied. I don't, but I can get the it back up. Um, okay, go for it. List of Sonic games. There we go. Nice. Okay, number one Sonic the Hedgehog. That didn't happen. We're, whoa. Okay, list of Sonic games, please. Sorry, I, I tapped that and it brought up locations of Sonic restaurants, so that was good. Oh, I'm hungry. You just... You had the option to have Eggos and you didn't have them. Ugh, okay, know. all right, Sonic the Hedgehog was first, yes. Uh, Sonic CD. Okay, no. Oh, that's way later. Yeah. Wait, Sonic the Hedgehog 2. <laughs> yes. Well, sort of. Remember, there was Sonic, Sonic Eraser and, and, and yeah, Sonic I'm, Control Yeah, I'm ignoring Park. the dumb ones. Okay. <laughs> Jeez. Um, Controversial here. Sonic the Hedgehog 2, then there was Sonic CD... Was that right? Uh, then there was Sega Sonic the Hedgehog, and Sega. then Sonic the Hedgehog CD. Yes. Okay, and then um, Sega Sonic Hedgehog. I'm not gonna like the the ports. I don't care much about. Um, was that a port? Of just the original one? Am I wrong? It's an arcade coin op. Uh, uh, yeah, which uses a trackball. That. Okay, that's fine. Sorry. Um, <clears throat> Sonic. Um, was Sonic CD Sonic Drift right? Nope. Oh, was that later? Um, Did you know that Sonic CD introduced both Metal Sonic and Amy Rose? I did know Metal Sonic. I didn't know that. That yeah. makes sense that that was the first Amy Rose one, because she wasn't in one or two yeah. or three. No, that makes sense. Um, what did she do in that game? Um, let's see. Sonic sets off on a time-traveling adventure to set things right, pursued by Ro Robotnik's latest creation, Metal Sonic, and a star-crossed hedgehog girl named Amy Rose, who came to Little Planet to follow her destiny. That's um, very specific. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, cool. Good for Sonic CD. Yeah. Shit. Okay. What came after Sonic CD that um, wasn't uh, Sonic Drift? Because, I mean, technically Sonic Drift came later, but not immediately. Is this one I'm gonna know? Yeah. 
Really? Yep. Ooh, shit. We already went over this. Um... Oh, actually, it's not on the list, but you did miss an early one that we played earlier today. That came after Sonic Adventure. That came after Sonic the Hedgehog. Though. No, I mean, it came actually in 1993. Um, first port was after, though. I, It's on the list. <laughs> no, no, no. I, there's a game you've missed that's not on the list the, that the, came out in 1993. You're talking about Eggman's Mean Bean Machine? Yeah. Yeah, but shit. Um... No, 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 but Eggman's Mean Bean Machine... Do I start from the beginning? No, thank God. Yeah. Nice, okay. Um, no, Eggman's Mean Bean Machine came out in 1993, but I don't think it was imported until later. I know it came out after Sonic the Hedgehog 3. Okay, all right, fair enough. Yeah. I mean, it's, again, it's still not No, I know. List, it but... also, I think, came out technically after 3D Blast. Okay. I don't know. Spinball. Yeah, very That's good. Yep, you were I, biding time. I was giving you the. Your I've time been thinking yeah. a lot. Um, nah, I was like, ball. you know what? It sounds like he's gonna process spin through ball. this. Um, all right, and then what's after uh, spin ball? Sonic Adventure Three. Yes, and right after that, Sonic Three D Black. No, no, and then no, it's no, stripped. No. Then it's stripped. Yeah. Sorry. Then there's a bunch of like really specific games. You have the like. You made fun of me for using the word earlier, but it is the word they use the in edu Wiki, edu the edutainment edu games. Edu edutainment. A lot of edutainment games, including one of the, the ones we played, which was Sonic Schoolhouse, which is what prompted uh, that conversation about... Um, Barbie! No. no. About, um, Never mind. <laughs> about <laughs> Sonic Dream uh, dreams, Collection. Dream Collection, yeah. yeah. Which came out earlier this year. Yeah. Um, okay, cool. So yeah, let's take it. What's after that? Let's, let's get to Sonic 3D Blast, and then let okay, me see if I can go Okay, let's move from, from there. there. Uh... Sonic 3D Blast, where you at? Where you at? Ooh, um... Wow, there was a bunch before Sonic 3D Blast, including things like Sonic and Knuckles and all of those. Oh, well, Sonic and Knuckles is just a patch on Sonic yeah. the Hedgehog 3. So. Well, yeah, I mean, it, it's an extension. Yeah, yes. but it was just yeah. Sonic the Hedgehog 3. Yeah. So, obviously, that came out around the time of Sonic the Hedgehog 3. Okay, so um, after Sonic 3D Blast, Sonic Schoolhouse is the next one. And yeah. then past that, we have not talked. So what comes after Sonic 3D Blast? Um, is this... There's one you don't know and one you definitely know. Was um, Are one of them a Tails game? No. No. We skipped over the Tails games that we were one talking about. One I definitely about. know? Yeah, one you definitely know. Um, Sonic... Give me a hint. Okay, yeah, I can. And that hint is going to be the year. It's 1998. We're getting late. We're getting late. Is that Sonic Adventure? It is. Wow! Yeah. That came way close to see, uh, 3D Blast. It did. It when really, did Sonic really Adventure did. come out? Sonic Adventure came out in 1998. And 3D Blast came out in uh, 96. Okay. So you can say whatever the hell you want about Sonic Adventure. But, but it oh came out two God. years after this. Look at what they achieved. <laughs> That's actually really remarkable. Like, like I've never actually put that this into perspective. Is but absolute shit compared to Sonic Adventure. That's really remarkable. Oh my God. Sega, go you. That's really cool. Like, um, in between Sonic Schoolhouse and Sonic Adventure, Sonic R, which is a racing game. Um, oh, I actually played that game. Did you? Yeah, cool. it's a kid. Okay, what came- alright, you know the one after Adventure. You definitely know it. And then you know the one after that. We're get, we're in territory, you know. Okay, alright. Um, one after Adventure- Adventure 2 It's didn't, still on the Dreamcast. Yeah, Adventure 2 came out on the Dreamcast. It did. But it didn't come out right after. Is this still 1998? No, this is 2000 now. Ooh, so is it Adventure 2? Nope. There's, was that 2002? Uh, Adventure 2001? 2 is 2001. 2001. Yep. Um... Um, okay, interesting. Oh, there's no more light. Okay, um... It's, it's, I mean, my hint and your, the, I can hear the way you're thinking and you're not no. gonna think of it. Um, my hint is, it's, it's one you're passionate about and you, you talk about a lot, that, uh, even earlier today. Really? Yeah. Um... I looked up pictures. Shuffle! Sonic yeah. Shuffle! There you go. Yes, Sonic Shuffle! Yes, Sonic yeah, Shuffle! Yeah, Sonic Shuffle. It's a party-based game by Hudson Soft, which it is here's literally a Mario design Party with Sonic, and it's awesome. Mario Party. There it it's is. It's awesome, guys. It's 
awesome. You're a huge... I played it, too. I mean, it, it, it's a really fun game. It's Mario Party. Let's, it's awesome. Let there be no mistake. It is Mario Party. Um, and guess what? Uh, guess what's awesome, Gina? Mario Party's awesome. Guess what else is awesome, Gina? Sonic. Fucking Sonic Shuffle. Okay. Give me, give me a little, buddy. There you go. Yeah. Okay, all right. What's after Shuffle, then? Uh, Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. There you go. Uh, Sonic Adventure yeah, 2, 2 Battle was the port on the GameCube. Yep. Yeah. And DX was the port of the first one. Okay, the next few are not ones that you may know, but boy, did I love them. I was all about Sonic Advance and Sonic Advance 2. Oh, I, you think I wasn't going to say Sonic Advance? I was waiting for the opportunity. I'm sorry. You Fair took enough. my turn. Gina. Fair enough. Hell yeah, Jeez. I like that. Well, you play, really... I played everything you played, Gina. <laughs> No, I'm serious. No, like, I guess that's fair. My entire knowledge of video games comes basically exclusively from what you said was okay for me to play. Uh, <laughs> and then I played I, Heavy Rain. Yeah. <laughs> hey, but that worked in reverse because then I played Heavy Rain and also Beyond Two Souls, and I really enjoyed that. Yeah, for anyone who thought they could trust my opinion in games, I know that I've been talking about how much I love Sonic, and I know that all if already <laughs> got me, that. Okay. that already got me into a hole. Uh, Heavy Rain might be my favorite game of all time, and fuck you. <laughs> Despite the, uh, despite the like brain slug mechanics, and uh, the... hey Gina, yeah, fuck you, it's amazing. I played through it and I enjoyed myself. I think it would make a magnificent HBO it should miniseries. Be a HBO miniseries. Yeah, I mean, no, like, it should be a BBC miniseries. Fair enough. Mm -hmm. Actually, yeah, no, that's yeah, fair. See, the tone. Yeah, no, I love it. I do. I get it. Really, like, could have not been a game. It kind of shouldn't have been a game. Well, something about it, man. So, so, that's a really interesting question, though, because I think it does what a lot of games don't do. And in fact, I think it does something that is unique in gaming, which is that, that feeling of, um, like, there's that amazing scene where... Wait, are we, are we spoiling it, or are we No, this is ambiguous? early. This is, this is... Are we still keeping it ambiguous? Yeah. Are you talking about the scene with him and his son? Yeah, where he's, yeah. Where he's microwaving dinner and, and you have the to scene sit there is and about stare at the 45 microwave. minutes. Yeah. It is a 45 minute I mean, minute you cut me off before I could. Sorry, yeah, I could, you go. But you yes, go. it is. It's a, a very, very excruciatingly long scene where you, as a single father, um, pick up your kid, you bring your kid home, and you need to entertain your child. Look at this. Look at this. Yeah, you can jump. You need to entertain your son. You need to put on cartoons. You have to make sure he does his homework. You have to make dinner, but you don't have food in the house. So you have to put a, a meal in the microwave and watch it as it microwaves. And if you pull it out too early, then your poor kid is stuck with like those undercooked hot pockets where it's like molten on the outside and icy on the <laughs> inside. And it's just this like this strangely despair-inducingly human. I've, moment. I've never been um, more sick in a game. It's just, it feels terrible. It's amazing. Awful. Because the game, the scene is also constructed perfectly that it is, I think, impossible to do everything in that scene. Yeah, no. You can't uh, make him be happy with watching cartoons and get his homework done and feed him and you can't yeah, do you all Yeah, you can't be a perfect father. The, the whole thing is like, you leave it feeling like, oh, I didn't do enough for my son. And that's right before your son gets kidnapped. Spoiler yeah. alert, sir. So that's the plot of the game. So like, if you didn't know that, listen. Um, God, it's so good. So, yes. Say what you will about Heavy Rain. I, I personally think it is a flawed game with weird mechanics. Um, but it's got really interesting characters. And, and it does things like that. Maybe not all the time, but... No, I mean, well, if it was an entire game of that, I'm not sure if I could handle that. Well, I more mean that, like, not everything it does is, is successful in that same way. Agreed. Um, but it does have these these truly remarkable moments that I don't think I've ever seen the likes of in other games. I think there's, like, there's a scene like that in Beyond Two Souls, too. Well, I think, um, what's, uh, Friction? What's his name? What's his, yeah, what's the, that guy that does them all who yeah. is now a joke, but yeah, I Yeah, who, who people make fun of. But and I love him. I really do. I love his work. I think he's very people, inspired. People don't like him because apparently he's super derivative. Like, he, he rips off, I'm, this is, I'm quoting, I don't know if this is true. Um, I have heard that, um, he copies scenes wholesale. And um, from other, um, like, movies and games. Really? Yeah. I heard people just don't like him because they think his games are bad. <laughs> I... That is not something I've listened to, um, just because I've enjoyed the games and, like, you know... Yeah. I did not know this either. Yeah, I... I 
it's something I'd need to look farther into, but I have yeah. I have heard that complaint, which is a very different, very specific no, complaint. No, that's yeah, I, I I mean that's that's not condonable. Um Yeah. Having a but, game that a lot of people think is bad is pretty condonable. Yeah. Um regardless, all I was gonna say is there's there's my absolute favorite scene from Beyond Two Souls was um the one where the main character Jody is um on a date. And yeah. Aiden, her sort of <laughs> overprotective, maybe evil spirit guardian, but also the other player and, and sort of your friend, um, he's in the room because he, he doesn't get to leave. Um, but he's trying to behave, or Jody really wants him to behave for the length of the date. And it's this really interesting scene because this is a two player game. Um, so Short One was playing as Jody and I was playing as Aiden. And I'm sitting there like, all I want is Jody to have a good time and be happy and for this date to go well. And I was I like, like let's fuck some shit up. Well, no, 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 I was Aiden. Oh, you and were And so Aiden. I was Aiden, so I'm sitting there like, I want everything to go well. But I was incapable of not messing with things. I couldn't do it. It was like this really long scene and I had control and I'm like, well, well, maybe nobody will care if I just like knock some pillows around or maybe nobody will care yeah. if I knock this p painting off the wall. And it's just this really interesting dynamic where you, re you get so into the character and the character is so defined by the game mechanics that like you end up behaving the way the character would anyway, even when you don't want to. Which I think some people would be really upset about that because it takes away the illusion of choice. I think that was kind of the point that they were going well, for. Well, it's not like it forced me to. I absolutely had the choice to not do it. I just, I couldn't. Yeah. <laughs> I had to mess with it. I like that they can get hit even if you don't. It's also, they have different movement patterns, like the little orange birds hop and they're kind of annoying to catch. It's really interesting. It's interesting, yeah. It's like kind of a cool game. It's like, it's weird. It's weird, but I like it. All right, uh, you want to keep going with the Sonic list? Yeah. Let's see how far I can get, because we're, we're in weird territory. We're about to get to shit territory, which upsets me. Is there one more? God. Okay, so the we stopped. The disappear really quick in this game. No, they do. Um, so let me tell you the game after where we stopped, just so that you know where we're at, if you're okay with that. Yeah, go for it. Um, the next one is Sonic Pinball Party in 2003 on the Game Boy Advance. Okay. So what's what year's the next one in? The next one's in 2003, and I am unfamiliar with it actually. Uh, let me give it some shots. Does it say a platform? It's Game Boy Advance. Sonic Battle. Uh, yeah, it is. How well about done. that? Well Damn it. done. Damn it. I am actually super impressed. <laughs> yeah, I played the game. Well done. Well, I don't think I did. I like that game a lot. All right, cool. Kay. How about that? Well done. Same year. On the Xbox and the PS2. And the... Did you see in Game? Huh? What's GCN? GameCube? GCN? Game... 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 Anyway, okay. on multi-system. Multi-system mm -hmm. release. Uh, what in year? 2003. Interesting. Sonic Heroes. Yep. Yeah. First title in the series that was released on all major consoles. Yeah, how about that? Keep going. Okay. Uh, immediately, uh, in 2004, on the Game Boy Advance. Game Boy Advance Sonic Battle 2? Uh, no. Was that a game? I don't know. I, I don't know if it. that was I'm a game. I'm just guessing. Uh, should I? Am I, I don't think. It this, it's Sonic Advance 3. Oh. They, there was a Sonic Advance 3? There was. I didn't even know that. Interesting. It says, Sonic Advance 3 returns and expands upon the team-based gameplay of Knuckles Chaotix. That was a game, like, way earlier. Yeah, right? that was a really early game around the same time as Tails Air Ride or Tails Tales, something. Yeah, Tails um, Pilot Instructor. Yeah. Kind of. um, then there's one I'm going to skip over at Sega Superstars. And then in yep. 2005, on the GameCube, Xbox, and PS2. Sonic. Um, mm, mm, I played it, didn't I? You have played this game. Mm, what year? 2005. Um, it's it's. I have played this it's game. It's not a classic Sonic, is it? It is. It is an infamous Sonic. People know of it. Um. I was thinking writers for a bit. 
but no. Nope. No. Nope. 2005? Um. Yeesh. I know there's one I'm missing. I feel it. It's I, a big one. I know it's a big it's one. It's a big one. And I played it. I bet I liked it too. Sonic. <laughs> Sonic. What, what systems? It's on all the major consoles. But like of the PlayStation 2. Uh, yeah, it's GameCube, Xbox, and PS2. Okay. Um, 2005? This isn't Sonic 06. Nope. Because that was 06. Because that was 06. <laughs> I, just, I don't know. I just wanted to make sure. Like, because that's nope. the most famous one. Um, Don't tell me. Do you want a hint? Yeah, give me a hint. Um... Is this a Sonic game? No. So it's not traditional. Is it a Sonic game? Does it say the word Sonic? It in does the not. That's what I mean. Is oh, it's it not a Sonic, a Sonic game. game. What the fuck? Um. Um. Is, there, is it a Tails based game? No. Is it? Oh, Shadow the Hedgehog! Yeah, there you oh, go! <laughs> oh, man! I don't know where to go. I you, just... You've killed everything. You just need to progress. Are you serious? Yeah, there's no more monsters. Um... Look, see? The little monster icons oh, shit, are gone. Oh, right. shit, Shit. Just don't die. Oh, my God. I might. <laughs> <laughs> if you die, we're moving on to a new game, because, like... <sighs> then then this is an important moment. This is a really important it? moment. All right. All the rings? God. The next one is on the DS... Sonic Chronicles. Nah. I mean, okay, Sonic I'm gonna skip this one if you're okay with that. Uh, oh god! Oh, we were close to not playing Sonic 3D Blast anymore. <laughs> no! <laughs> Can I please try one more yeah, time? Yeah, go for it. Yeah, I... you, you do. Yeah. Yeah, just progress. I, I forgot I could yeah. just do that. I forgot. Um. Okay, so what? Uh, the one I'm skipping is Sonic Rush. Oh, yeah, I wasn't gonna get that. Yeah, so, so the next one is a multi-platform release in 2006. Okay. Um... Oh, um... But, Sonic but, 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 Huh? Sonic 06. Sonic the Hedgehog. No, it's not. There's another one? There's one before um, Sonic the Hedgehog. Sonic the Hedgehog was released on... On Xbox 360, yeah. Yeah, and the PS3 in 2006. Also There's... in 2006, though, there was a Sonic game released on the GameCube, the Xbox, and the PS2. Did I play it? You've said its name. I have. Yeah. You've guessed it before. Sonic Riders. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Then, yes, it's Sonic the Hedgehog. Nice. Uh, the controversial next generation title. Um, controversial. Yeah. Once again, I'll, I'll admit, liked it when I played it. So, uh, there's a PSP game, which I'm gonna guess... Sonic... That wasn't Sonic Chronicles. Sonic Chronicles... No. Oh, I think I played this one. I played one on the PSP. I know, and I I think I actually think we own this, but I Sonic was the Sonic game? Yeah. Sonic is the first side scrolling racing platform title. Sonic Silver the Hedgehog is reintroduced, this time from a different future. <gasps> I played this one, 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 I played this one. What's it called? Sonic Rivals. So I that was the one I played! <laughs> <laughs> All right, what's what's immediately after Sonic Rivals on the Wii? Um, Sonic Unleashed. Nope. Damn. Oh, Sonic and the Secret Ring. Yep. We own that. Never played it. Or I played as a kid. And actually, so fun story about Sonic and the Secret Ring. I, you know, I like Sonic 06. So I was a Sonic lover for way longer than I was. Had any business being a Sonic then, lover? I was like a person then. I was like twelve. Like, <laughs> you were like... I had the I I was bar mitzvah. I was a man in the Jewish faith. <laughs> like I was not supposed to be like in Sonic 06. I will say though, Sonic and the Secret Rings was the first game that little Jake was like, you know, I don't think this is good. <laughs> I'm willing to guess this is bad. <laughs> so yeah, that was the first one. That That's was interesting. That was actually. the game for me. That was mine like, was Sonic Heroes. Um, because I really enjoyed Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, obviously. Yeah. Obviously, I love that But you game, were also, but... you were older during Sonic Heroes, no, you know? No, of course, So yeah. for me, Sonic Heroes was kind of cool, because I'm like, so many characters. Yeah, They were all fair. the same. They were just, you know, different skins, but still. Um, all right, keep going. Let's see. Oh, this is going to be a little bit of a longer episode, because I want to get to modern day, and then we'll, then we'll call it quits. Fair enough. <laughs> so it's not based on the game at all, you just want to, you just want to get there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I just, you know. That's fair. Um, I'm gonna skip over, unless you don't want me to skip over No, don't things. skip. Let's see if I can do my best. Okay. Unless it's like a weird Japanese title. I don't it's not. Do that. Uh, it, game on the DS in 2007. 
Uh, it shows Blaze's world for the first time. Oh! Oh, man. Oh, man. Journeying with Tails, Blaze, and yep. headstrong newcomer Marine the Raccoon. Nope. <laughs> My <laughs> Marine the Raccoon lost me. <laughs> what game is that? That's Sonic Rush Adventure. Didn't didn't play that one. Okay, I am gonna skip Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. No, I was ready for oh, them. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm Don't sorry. skip them. I'm sorry. <laughs> I was, like, waiting for that. All right, there's another... Oh, when we get to Winter Olympics, I got you. Okay, there's another game on the PSP in 2007. I... Should I know it? Uh, it's a sequel to Sonic Rivals. Sonic so, Rivals 2? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Then there's another edutainment game that I'm gonna skip. Okay, next. On the Wii and PS2 in 2008. On the Wii and PS2? Yes. What specific consoles? <laughs> That's like they had a dartboard and they just threw at the consoles they thought would be interesting. Um, That's true. Well, yeah. Those aren't even the same generation. I know PS3 was out at that point. Like, for a while. They've yeah. been putting games out on it. Shit. Um, <laughs> oh, where's that bird? Give me that bird. Give me that bird. Give me that bird. Um, the major focus of this game is Ark of the Cosmos. If that helps you at all. The hell? <laughs> The fuck does that mean? Is this <laughs> oh is this God. unleashed? No. The Ark of the Cosmos? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It's not a grinder zero gravity. Th what does Ark of No Bird Friends? <laughs> <laughs> what does Ark of the Cosmos can't go mean? Back. There was an Are you kidding? Are you kidding? Okay, there you go. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Ark of the Cosmos. Okay, what happened on the Wii in 2008? Is that unleashed? No. Just yeah. on the Wii? Yeah. Oh. This is not a Sonic title. Ooh. But it is a significant yes. feature for Sonic. Um, he was featured in Brawl. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, on the DS in 2008. Sonic Chronicle. Yep. Yeah, I was ready for that one. I go. liked that game. I, I never played that one. It was, it was, it was a true role-playing game. Oh, oh, that's interesting. Yeah, I mean, you were still Sonic and his friends, but, like, it was one of those things where, like, each one of them had special powers that, was like... Was it, like, um... I actually have the, um, um, case for it in this room. Really? Yeah, I will, in between this episode and the next, get it for you. Is it, like, um, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, sort of? Um, a Not... little bit. I okay. liked Mystery Dungeon, too. Yeah, no... Can we be done? So, this episode's uh, over, and <laughs> we'll continue our talk next time and probably be playing a different game. Yeah, alright. Alright. See you next time, folks. Bye, team.